Hello and welcome back to the fifth tutorial of the Cocos 2DX JavaScript tutorial series. In this tutorial we'll cover positioning a little more using the move to function. The move to function basically moves a sprite in this instance to a particular location on the, on the device's screen. The end position will always be the same but the route it takes and how fast it looks will be different. Let's get into the code. We're going to be using the base code from tutorial free. A link will be in the description plus a link will be in the description for the source code from this project as well. So open up the Xcode project. We want to go to the myapp.js. After we add the sprite as a child, we want to create a sprite action. You can call it whatever you want by calling sprite action equals cc dot move to dot create help if I spell create right open bracket here I want to put a 2 that's just the time it's going to take to perform the action comma cc dot p this is going to be the end position and in here we're going to put 100 by 100 let's just sort out the formatting the formatting is terrible for JavaScript on Xcode Hopefully they improve that. Now we need to actually run the action. This dot my sprite dot run action open bracket sprite action close bracket semi colon oops wrong button. And if we click play, it should move from the center of the screen to 100 by 100. Well, there you got your world here initially, and now it's come here. What we're going to do is change the initial position to zero, so it'll be in the bottom left of the screen. Let me show you that now it's moving up. But the end position is still the same. Unlike the move by, if we were to do move by 100 by 100, and the starting position will be here, it would come here. The starting position will be here, it will be roughly end here. Whereas the move to, the end position is always the same. So there you go. That's this tutorial. In this tutorial we cover the move to positioning. The next tutorial we'll be looking at positioning a little more but we're going to jump in and we'll be looking at the jump by. Thanks for watching.